picture. Hello? No, no, <laughs> not possible. Not possible? I'm sorry? No, because, because I'm in the map. I, I am in my bed yet. <laughs> oh, so do you want to have a conversation or not? Well, if you want. <laughs> But it's so strange because I am in my bed yet. Huh? I, well, have you... a, I have had a very bad night. Them, I cannot sleep it. Oh, okay. Then I'm here yet. Okay. <laughs> Well, well, you put in a request and here we are. <clears throat> um, can I get your name and where you're from? My name is Cecilia Zanon. I am from Brazil. Okay. Belo Horizonte. <laughs> All right. My name is Michael. I'm from the U.S. Nice to meet you. Um, oh, today. nice to meet you too. <laughs> Wonderful. I'm going to uh, show you some numbers and I need you to choose a number. And... Uh, After you choose a number, I will show you a picture depending on what number you choose, and we will talk about the picture, okay? Okay, and number seven. Number seven, all right. Let me block off number seven. <laughs> all right. Okay, here we go. Let me get the picture ready. So in a moment, I will switch around my camera, and we will talk about what you see, okay? Are you ready? Okay. Okay, I'm ready. Yes, we're ready. Let's do it. Here we go. <laughs> All right, give me just a oh, moment to nice. focus. I, I can see a knife. I can see a garlic, some vegetables, and onions, and pepper on. Uh, yeah, I think so. Uh-huh. And what do you think is the location of this picture? Uh, maybe in a kitchen. Okay, and do you think it's a home kitchen or maybe a professional kitchen at a restaurant? Oh, maybe in a professional kitchen. Okay, and what, what about the picture makes you think that it's in a professional kitchen? Because the knife is very uh, professional, it's not from, uh, for home. <clears throat> uh -huh. Maybe more of a high, qu high quality knife? <clears throat> yeah, the Up the knife, yes. <laughs> okay. And uh, I heard you say garlic. I think I heard you say peppers. Um, Pepper? Yes. How about the one, I'll try to put my finger right over, wait, let me use my pen. The one right over here. Uh oh, folk, that one. What do you think this one is? It's onion. Yes, an onion. And I think they might even say maybe a red, red onion because they have a white onion, red onion, I think. Um, yeah. No, no. No, no? No, no. White. White onion. <laughs> White onion. Okay. And uh, what kind of meal do you think they are preparing? Uh, the red one is very nice. Uh-huh. But what, what kind of meal? What is the food going to be part of? Mm, I'm sorry. I cannot understand this part. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Uh, if you don't understand, I can try to explain it a different way. Um, yes, I, I think you, you, you asked me about the, the smell, huh? but it's not about the no, smell. No, uh, about the meal, the meal, mm -hmm. uh, the food. They're preparing this food for a meal, maybe breakfast, dinner, lunch, the meal. Oh, okay, okay, they, they will. They, uh, uh, it's for, uh, for a lunch, yes, obviously. Okay, and uh, w w how do you think they're going to use the vegetables? Are they only serving uh, vegetables? Um, it or? Maybe to, to, to complain uh, meat uh -huh. or, or a soup, maybe a soup. Uh-huh, sure. Okay, <laughs> and uh, let's see, do you like to eat vegetables? Sorry? Do, do you like to eat vegetables? Yes, I love <laughs> Ah, all, wonderful. All, all day. <laughs> okay. All right. Thank, thank you. I'm going to switch back around and ask you one more question. What is your favorite vegetable? Oh, there are no one favorite in Brazil. You have many, many, many delicious vegetables, and they, they smell, the flavor, the smell is very good because we have many sun, 
and it's it is a, a, a very nice. I I eat uh, all day, all, uh -huh. not all day, every day. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> not all day. <laughs> all day you'd be like. No, right, no, no, yeah. not, not, I'm not fat. Uh, not all day, every but, day. But even, even if you ate vegetables all day, you probably wouldn't be fat, right? Because your body is so easy yeah, for yeah. the process. <laughs> okay, well, thank you for coming live. Well done. And you're welcome you. to come back in the future. Thank you very much. All I'm right. happy to meet you. Thank you. <laughs> all right, obrigado. Okay, welcome. All right, bye-bye. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Hello, sir. How are you doing? Good. How are you? <clears throat> I'm fine. I'm fine, sir. What's um, going on? I'm. Uh, I often come uh, when you when you uh, come live here, and I uh, listen to your streaming. That's quite nice, and you spoke so I mean accurate and slowly, slowly and very clearly. Everyone, I think, every non-native uh, speakers can easily understand your. I mean, uh, affluency. That's good. Thank you. You're, you're welcome. And your video is, I think, frozen. Yeah, I, I actually, uh, I have, um, I have a bad cam result, so maybe. Well, but now we... it's okay. I'm... Can you see me now? I think uh, my video is uh, not great. I mean... How How about we do this? I'm going to uh, disconnect, but then I will. Reconnect with you. Uh, okay. Oh, okay, that's good. That's and just to make sure you are Faisal Awan, yes. right? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, so I will reconnect okay. in just a moment. Okay. okay, sir. All right. Okay, so hopefully we can have a good uh, connection. Let's take a look. See if I can find him again. Faisal Awan. All right. We have. All right, let's see if I can search. Faisal R1, let's see what happens. Right now it says unable to join, but sometimes it does that. All right, let's search Faisal. Aha, there we are. We're going to add Faisal a one and hopefully we have a better connection. Let's do it. Come on, Instagram, give us a wonderful connection. Hello? Hello. Aha. Yes, sir. Still, I think my, my video is not showing. I, I, I don't know what's the problem is here. Well, but at, at least I can see. Uh, I, at least I, I can see your face. Uh, <laughs> can you, uh, I think the problem is maybe in the camera. I think I don't know. Okay. But well, still, I mean, as but long at least can you hear me at least? Uh, this, this is, I think, okay for me. Yes, I can hear now, you. So we'll give it a try and we'll see how it goes. Okay. Okay, All so right. sir, I'm. Oh, I'm, uh, yes. I'm gonna select five. Number five. Because oh. I, yeah, I always select five in my life. I don't know why. <laughs> it, it's your lucky number, huh? Okay. Yeah. Yes. Maybe. All right. I'm gonna find the picture. Give me one moment. Yes. Yes. Okay. So I'm gonna turn the camera around and I will show you the picture. All right. Okay. Give me a moment to adjust. Okay. So tell me, what do you see? Um, a man is, I think, uh, touching uh, on his uh, mobile screen. I don't know. Maybe he's uh, clicking. Uh, maybe he's clicking some option, or maybe he's, uh, taking selfie on a front cam, like this. You know, I think uh, he's capturing selfie. Um, in okay. the picture, it 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 looked like, and uh, seriously, uh, I mean, I got the number exactly to the my nature because I always uh, use my mobile. I mean, addicted to mobile. <laughs> uh -huh. And in yeah. the pic in the picture, can you describe the man's clothing? Uh yeah, uh, he is wearing. I mean, um, I mean, a suit. A Pant coat, you know, uh, coat and shirt, and it's, it looks sure. like you know, for, sure. yeah, for, I mean, formal dressing, like you know, like office, um, office dressing, like. Right. So we could say maybe a black suit coat with a white dress. Yeah, shirt. black, 
yes uh black suit color uh, with white shirt yes and, and it looks uh, phone is iphone it look like iphone i don't know <laughs> i mean okay and it looks like he's not wearing a tie right i don't see any tie yes yes yeah. yes yes he is not wearing tie yes all right let's see if we can focus again da, da, da. can you tell me what do we call the white parts at the end of the sleeve that are sticking out from his suit coat so at the very end of the 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 white part of the sleeve what do we call yeah. that there's a word in english uh, um sleeves i think um shirt sleeves um right um so they're part uh, they're part of the shirt sleeves but at the very end where you button them together there's a word that describes that what do you think uh let let me think um uh, uh i'm not getting the word exactly in my mind right now <laughs> sure. uh, sure. i had i have my ielts i have my ielts exam on um uh, saturday <laughs> uh-huh. and yes sir and uh, um the word is not coming in my <laughs> mind <laughs> it, it's okay it they're called cuff. Uh, they're called shirt cuff 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 i think uh huh that's right shirt cuffs so yeah that, shirt cuffs yeah. right and sometimes like if uh they're unbuttoned someone might say oh your your cuffs are unbuttoned something like that yes yeah. so it's the yes, end part cuff. of the shirt right <laughs> yeah it, it is a common word i and i have listened many times but uh, now uh, uh, this time it was not coming in my mind <laughs> i don't know <laughs> it, it's all right no worries and we we can and can't... sir please give me uh, some uh, some ideas useful ideas and suggestions about ielts because 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 i will i will give my test on on uh, saturday and yes so what you think i mean i should try to do in a speaking section because uh, because there i will speak at least 13 minutes in front of uh, examiner uh huh well i uh, today all we're, we're doing a conversation so we're practicing that part uh so we uh, okay, can okay 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 it's okay okay i i just yes i got i i i got it because uh, the topic of your uh, live streaming is not uh, matching with my question so yes it's okay okay But generally i mean i i i am very active on your i mean uh, streaming whenever you come live i try to <laughs> i listen you and absorb as much as, as can uh, my listening is good and i i listen very clearly everything no matter someone is speaking fast or um, i mean slow okay well today i got, I got today, it today i have an agenda and this is a lesson so i i stick to my agenda and today we're talking yes, about yes. we're talking about pictures <clears throat> so okay so you are talking about the pictures so yes. that's cool right so i showed and, you a pic and how i i judge i mean i got the right answer because and i judged it well i your picture i think well a good start is to let me talk <laughs> because yes. if i talk i can explain <clears throat> what we're going to do but you kind of keep cutting me off so it's difficult to have a conversation okay okay sir thank you okay so i was going to ask you about the picture are you would would you want to answer a question about the picture yes 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 okay we we can't see the location but what would you say is the location of this picture where do you think this guy is um can you zoom it a little bit i mean uh, uh you're going to, you you're going to have to uh, use your, your imagination because we can't um, see we can't see the background where do you think I he think, is i think he is standing in a restaurant i'm i am maybe in office and i um 
I can't tell you exactly location because I I just I can just watch um I can just see his uh, just a body I mean you know front side like this so right <clears throat> but the, yes. the the nice thing about using our imagination is we can add extra details or give a possibility yes. where he might be standing so if you ask me I would say since he's wearing a business suit and a uh, business clothing he could be just maybe leaving work or he could be arriving at work or maybe he's on his lunch break and he just stepped out of the office maybe to send a text to his wife or his uh his child or something like that so there are many different possibilities yeah maybe he is sending a uh, proof to his wife look i am uh, look i am on the office i am i am not anywhere <laughs> he's sure. taking the selfie <laughs> <laughs> he's proving proving to his wife that he is actually at the office. Right? Yes, yes sir. Okay. All right. Well, thank you for coming live. I need to move forward so other people also have a chance. Uh okay, okay. Uh hang on just for a second. So, I mean, uh when you will give me some piece of advices because I want some piece of advices from you to prepare no, I, my I, I I I don't just, have I mean, time. I don't have time for that today. I have to move forward. I don't do assessments. I have uh, a, a specific agenda that I'm going to do today, and I need to move. Hello. Hello. How are you? Great. How are you? Yeah. Fine. Thank you. How's it going? Fabulous. Uh, what is your name, and where are you from? Uh, yeah, my name is Chia. I'm Iranian, and uh, I'm happy to talking to you. Okay. Uh, my name is Michael. I'm from the U.S. Very nice to meet you. Thank you. Thank okay. you so much. All right. So I'm going to show you some numbers, and depending on the number you pick, that will be the picture that you get. Okay. Okay. All right. So should I pick one number? Yeah. Yes. Three. Choose choose one number. What's that? Three. 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 Oh. All yeah. right. Let's do three. Okay. So I'm going to find you a picture. and then we will talk about it okay okay and you tell me what you see all right here we go i'm going to turn the camera around are you ready yeah i'm ready yes here we go okay yeah, teddy bear and children playing games i don't know from outside so any uh -huh. question sure and you said children Uh how many kids so, do you a see? A child, a child, a child, yeah. A sure, baby. right. Baby. And is it a, a boy or a girl? What do you think? Yeah, it's definitely a boy. Okay. And can you describe what kind of clothing he's wearing? Yeah, blue shirt and black pants. Uh it's not look like uh it's it's uh it's a baby clothes and I, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Ah, uh, yeah, sorry. All Shirt right. And pants, so, I think. Sure. Sure. And we can't quite see, but what do you think the boy is doing with his hands? Uh, playing with maybe some toys. Sure. And uh, can you tell me about the weather and the environment? Yeah, it's definitely sunny. because it's it's in outside and a baby cannot stay in the cold weather uh and maybe sure. summer okay and what do you think uh the ground is made of or what do you think they're sitting on top of <clears throat> yeah uh it's i think it's a wooden uh Place, I think, yeah. Am uh -huh. I right? Like, a, I I would agree. Maybe a wooden floor or something like that. Yeah. And so, what what are some possibilities for the location? Hmm. I, I think it's looked like a near the beach. Aha. Uh -huh. So yeah. maybe like a do, do a dock. <laughs> or yeah, maybe or in outside the outside of the house, and uh, because some houses. they have some wooden floor uh in balcony right maybe a a porch 
or a balcony or maybe a wooden walkway or something like that? Sure. Yeah, yeah. I think so. Uh, maybe, maybe it's not. <laughs> yeah, that's the beautiful thing about the picture. We can say whatever we want. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just talking is important about things. Exactly. Just yes, exactly. Right. And can you tell me uh, what time of day do you think it is? Um, I think the best time that we can say it's afternoon. Okay. And if you chose, if you had to choose a number, what would you say? Uh, maybe four or five. Okay. Sure. So um, maybe almost evening then. Oh uh, yeah. I okay. Think so. <laughs> Sure. And who do you think is taking the picture? Maybe daddy or mom, uh, because the brother and sister are, don't like to talk. <laughs> <laughs> they take picture okay. of their brother or sister. Maybe daddy or mom, I don't know. Uh -huh. Definitely mommy. <laughs> sure. And how long do you think the kid is able to sit still and be occupied by himself? Uh, so if, if you let, let children alone, maybe they can sit five or seven hours without, <laughs> <laughs> without eating because, because children like to play. They, sure. The whole time, yeah, they, they can stay maybe four hours. Okay. And how old would you say this child is? Two, two and a half okay. or one and a half. I don't know. Okay. It's, it's, very, it's, it's very difficult to, uh, uh, to decide that how old is he because uh, uh, he's sitting and we cannot see his face. Yes, I agree. And see, one more question. Where do you think he got the teddy bear or who gave the teddy bear to him? Mm -hmm. uh, maybe after in his birthday time. The grandma or grandfather uh, give him this gift to, to him. <laughs> oh, sure. Okay. All right. And if uh, if that was a movie, can you think what title would you give the movie? Oh, is it reconnecting? Oh, ah, okay. Yes, now we can. Uh, so. I never think about the name of the movie. <laughs> it's my first time to think to create a movie name for a picture. I think the best name that we can say is Teddy with Teddy Bear. <laughs> sure. I don't know. So what do you think? Sure. So you choose the name. Sure. I was you thinking it would probably be like a nice kids movie or something nice with the family. And I was thinking like Teddy and me, or Teddy and I, or my, my best buddy Teddy, <laughs> or something uh, like that. Yeah. But, yeah. Okay. Well, thank you for coming live. Well done. And you're welcome thank to you come so back much. in the future. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. I, I'm so right. appreciative just talking to you. All right. Very nice to meet you. Have a good day. Nice to meet you too. Have right, a good day. All right. Bye bye. Hello. How are you? Oh, hello, what's up? Not much. I remember you. You came live before. Welcome back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I remember. Yes. Okay. Are you ready to choose a number? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay. Mm. Eight. I'm sorry? I, I said eight. Eight. Okay. All right. Let me mark it off. Number eight. Okay, let me find the picture. Just one moment. So I will show you a picture and we will talk about it. Okay. Yeah. All right. Here we go. All right. I'm going to switch it around. Let's do it. Okay, let me adjust. All right. So can you tell me what do you see? It is impossible to judge. I think it is a ship. A ship, okay. Yeah. And can you tell me about the condition of the boat or the condition of the ship? 
Yeah, it is very very in bad condition because uh, I think it is very old and the actual name is expired. Uh huh. Right. And do do you want to ride on this ship? <laughs> no, I don't want. <laughs> <laughs> what 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 would happen if you rode on this ship? Uh, there are a lot of possibilities to means uh, go towards that. Uh huh. You probably sink, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Is it right? Yeah. And how, there is how, no doubt if we ride this ship, but we ride this ship, so definitely we will go towards that. Yes, it will definitely sink, and everyone will probably die. <laughs> yeah, yeah. How how old do you think this ship is? Uh, I think it is. Uh, Twenty or thirty year old. Okay, all right. Yeah. And how long do you think the ship has been beached on shore? And if we say beached on shore, it means that it's run up on the beach. Mm, I think uh, five or six years. Five or six years. Okay. Yeah. And what do you think they use the ship for? when it was in good condition mm. i think it is used for means uh, just for people i think okay just for people I to can't... yeah okay yeah yeah but yeah is it possible that it was a fishing boat no i don't like that okay And how many people do you think can fit on this ship? I think uh, um like I'll I think fifty people. O- o- only two people? 50 50. Oh, 50. Uh-huh. Yeah, it is very big so. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And can you tell me about the weather in this picture? Uh it is very clear i think okay and yeah. if if we can't see any blue sky what can we say because the sky is very gray what do we yeah, call yeah. it uh, i say it is very means good weather okay oh, okay and we can say the cloud the sky is cloudy right it's full of clouds we can't it, see uh, yeah. yeah we can say the sky is cloudy but if there are some kind of clouds <laughs> only then Okay. All right. Okay, well I'm going to switch back around. All right. So we could say we saw an old ship or an old boat that was beached. A uh, beach yeah. means like it's up on the beach and it's uh someone in the comments said stranded like it's stuck. Yeah, <laughs> you yeah. You probably yeah. can't get out. Okay. All right. Well, thank you for coming live. I need to move forward and up oh, is frozen you you're welcome to come back in the future okay yeah thank you all right thank you all right bye bye thank you so much teacher mario hello how are you how are you <laughs> great i'm great too thank you all right are you ready to choose a number mm, yeah sure number 6 number 6 okay yeah all right Let me cross it off and I'm going to find your picture. Give me one moment. Choose an easy one, please. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I I I stayed in in the line for too long and I'm so stressed and shy right now. <laughs> so just you, bear with me and help me. <laughs> you should you should say choose one which will maximize my English improvement. <laughs> okay, sure. Do that. <laughs> uh huh. All right, let's see. You picked that one, so I will find it. All right, give me one second. I have to scroll through. All right. Wait there. Ah, I think I passed it. One moment. Ah, uh-huh. there it is. I don't know I'm about hoping... easy. Okay, I'm hoping this one is an easy one. Can well, maybe <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I'll just show you a picture of a black screen. <laughs> I uh, yeah that would be all uh, awesome. <laughs> Are you like yes it's night? <laughs> okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Here we go. 
All right, let me adjust and move it down just a little bit. All right. Whoop. So okay. what do you see in this picture? Um, uh, um, traffic sign. It's, it's like stop and it's <laughs> red. And uh -huh. so um, I don't know what's, what, what's the shape called? Uh -huh. Octagon. Oh, okay. I didn't know that word. So um, I can see uh, some um, bushes in the background, and uh, there's um, there are some meadowlands, or I can see uh, the sea, the sea in the background as well. Uh -huh. The sky is cloudy, and it's overcast and um, the time of the the day must must be um, um, maybe uh, dawn. Uh huh. And mm -hmm. I think you're you <clears throat> you're anticipating all of my questions. Wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Thank you because you know I have um, I, I I was watching you uh, you know the live the whole live so I. I, I knew that uh, what question you were going to be asked. So. <laughs> ah, well, let's see. You said the word overcast, and can you explain to everyone what does overcast mean? Overcast is like when the sky is full of you know clouds and there's no light from uh, from the sun and it's completely cloudy. Uh, uh huh. And, and when it's over, go ahead. Uh, sorry, I, I was. I wanted to say that you know the um, um, the at how do I say it? I, I don't know. It's kind of you know a little bit dark due to to you know the clouds, and that's my definition for. Um, sure, sure, sure. Yeah. I would agree. Overcast is when <clears throat> the sky is completely covered in clouds. It's kind of dark, and it makes us feel what. What kind of emotion? Depressed. Depressed. Yeah. <laughs> right. Okay, so we have a stop sign. What do we call the thing that is holding up? Let's see if I can find it. What do we call this part that's holding up the stop sign? Um, it's, it is called a uh, leg. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> It's, it's the right idea, right? So this unique stop sign has one leg. Well, it's the right right idea. We can call it the post. Oop, let me. Oh uh, yeah, the post. Yeah, I I knew that word. Like um, um light post, for example. Yes, exactly. Uh, you could have um, and if it's like really long and maybe round, it might be a pole, like an electric pole for high wires yeah. and stuff. But here we would probably say a post, right? Yeah, okay. post. And uh, uh, what would you describe this location? Would you choose uh, rural or would you choose urban? Um, rural, because it, I see no, um, you know, apartments or buildings. Uh-huh. And so, what kind of people do you think come through here? Uh, people that are bored of, you know, living in um, urban places, and uh, they, you know, they need silence and uh, beautiful nature. They come to such places. And unfortunately, it's an overcast day. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately. <laughs> yeah. And. And do these people, do they come for long term or just short term? No, they just you know, come for a visit. And they, because, you know, they they have jobs and they, they have to be at work uh, you know, after the holiday or the vacation. vacation. I think you call it like vac vacation. Sure, sure. In the, in the U.S., it's very common for us to say vacation. I think in the UK they often use holiday, so yeah. it just depends. Yeah. And 
Uh, a two-part question. Who took okay. this picture and why did they take it? Mm. It's, a, it's a hard question. Um, <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> maybe a, a, a police officer. <laughs> okay. And why? To, to make sure to make sure the stop uh, sign is, uh, you know, uh, it's in its place. I mean, it's uh, some, but no one has, you know, stolen it. <laughs> <laughs> uh huh. Sure. Uh, is it? I'm gonna get. I'm gonna give you a scenario, and you tell me if you think it's likely or unlikely. Okay. 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 Is yeah. it possible that a photographer came out and they want to try to do something unique? So instead of taking a picture of the scenery of the beautiful coast like everyone else, they're like, hey, a stop sign. <laughs> <laughs> maybe, uh, um, maybe someone from a place uh, who, you know, they don't have any cars or uh, things like that. It's... Uh, <laughs> Maybe it's something new for him or for them. <laughs> and yeah, they've taken a picture of it. Sure, sure, I, I, exactly. Especially if they're from a different country where they have different shapes or different words on their stop signs. Sure, right. Yeah, ours are uh, circular. Uh-huh, uh-huh. And yeah. what was the name of the shape again for the stop sign? I forgot it. <laughs> I need to look it up again. <laughs> uh huh. It's because it has eight sides. It's like an oct, like uh, let's see, an octopus, right? Octo yeah. means eight. So this is an octagon. O octagon, right? It's uh -huh. O C O C T O. Wait, wait. O C T A G O N. I think octagon. Yes. Okay, I will look it up after uh, after the live. It's in I the comments. Habibi Asadi put it. It's octagon. Yep. Yeah, I know the name of some shapes, but I don't know this this one. Uh huh. Well, now you do. Woo! -hoo! Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> okay, so if this picture was, uh, I don't know, the introduction to a movie, what would the name of the movie be? Stop to see the nature. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm thinking of peaceful things. Maybe a little bit disappointed that it's overcast. But yes, makes sense. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. So, I'm... Uh huh. Uh, yeah, I just wanted to say that I'm a huge fan of your lives, and because you know they're very creative and. I love participating in your life, so thank you for adding me and um, letting me be a part of this. Uh, um, this part, part of this, uh, I don't know, <laughs> this live. <laughs> oh, sure. Thank you. I appreciate it because you guys help me as well. Because even though it's like one picture, there are a million different combinations of conversations you can have. Because once yeah. we put in, in our imagination, anything can happen, right? And suddenly we can talk about so many different kinds of vocabulary, phrases, idioms. And it helps me as a teacher to be able to teach better in the future. So I say thank you to you too. Thank you. You're welcome. And I'm sorry if I, you know, butted in sometimes when you were talking. <laughs> <laughs> well, there, there's a difference. Sometimes it's because there's a delay. A delay in the connection, yeah. right? But usually we can anticipate that and then we stop. But sometimes people keep talking no matter what. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. And it's a little bit different. Yeah. So, okay. Thank you so much. All and right. Thank you guys thank you. for watching. Bye. Uh huh. All right. Have a great day. Thank you, you too. Bye. Bye well, bye. Okay. All right. Ah. Perfect timing. All right, so my time is just about up. I want to say thank you to everyone in the comments and everyone who came live. Thank you very much. I had a wonderful time. And like I said to Kian, 
you guys help me as well to become a better teacher, right? Because I have to adapt to you guys, your skill level, your vocabulary level, and, and how we talk. So hopefully, I'm always improving, just as you guys, hopefully, are always improving. Okay? All right? Until next time, I will say see you soon. Have a wonderful day, evening, afternoon, midnight, <laughs> wherever you are in the world. Okay? Thank you and have a wonderful day. See you soon.